they're usually raised by their mothers. Um, he's very young, between four and six weeks old. So his mother probably injured or killed by the fire and the firefighters found him with badly burned feet. He couldn't stand and really singed all over. Oh, yes. Well, he's got a lot of spirit for sure. He's a feisty guy, which is great. He ate well from the time he came in, which is really good. All of his blood work was normal and we've x-rayed his chest twice now to see if there's any damage from smoke inhalation and so far, no. So he's in the best position he could be. He's got a bit of a long road ahead of him just because the feet, as you can see from the pictures, are so damaged. We really had to remove all the covering of the paw pads. He's had one toe amputated. in the wild they uh, often hunt with their mom till they're two years old so they're pretty big majestic beasts before they separate from their mom so a little guy like this even if we can get him back to health we can't mentor him to be a hunter in the wild so he'll always have to be in captivity but he'll be in a very good spot Mountain lions are our tiger. They're our lion for North America. They're these majestic alpha predator species, uh, so important to our ecosystem. And to see them so devastated, really by human action towards the environment, you know, I think it brings out a lot of emotion because they are such beautiful, amazing animals.